Uh, hello guys. Um, how we all doing today? <laughs> so, a uh, quick one. Uh, regarding this um, Mobad death, the unfortunate death of um, one of the most uh, talented artists that uh, Nigeria will ever produce, Mobad. First of all, I'd like to um, say uh, may his soul rest in perfect peace and uh, may the Lord give his family the fortitude to bear the loss. You would all agree with me that um, if you if you see how much of um, attention his death has, has drawn, you would all agree with me that that guy has a whole lot to offer. And uh, it's quite unfortunate that we didn't even get to see the the tip, if I may use that word, the tip of how much talent and um, uh, blessing it should have been to this uh, to this country. He has so much glory. He had so much grace. He had so so much to offer because. Um, the way and manner at which a lot of people are, are interested in knowing the cause of his death, you would know that, no, he's not just a, a regular person. So I hope uh, in our quest to, to get justice, I hope we all are learning one or two things on this matter because uh, it's really sad. Day by day, I, I just can't get myself to really wrap my head around what um, he could have done right to still keep him alive and it's so so sad so um, I have a lot of questions myself regarding this uh, situation a whole lot of questions but then uh, the social media frenzy one just needs to be very careful with the way you you go about these things you know you have to put your sentiments your emotions in check to be sure that um, you are not uh, allowing your emotions cloud your sense of reasoning. We all want justice for his, his killers, and that one we must get. We all want justice, and we must get that. Uh, whoever it is that is trying to help um, the accusers, that's uh, uh, Sam Larry and Naramali right now, whoever it is that is advising them right now, trust me, the person is advising them wrongly. Because um, you are being accused of bullying someone, um, threatening him, frustrating him till uh, he died. And then there are videos, several videos of these uh, accusations. You know, while he was on a music video set, I think Samurai went to attack him or something. We've seen videos of uh, maybe... Uh, Naramali's boy is beating him up or something like that, you know. And then I've seen Sam Larry release one or two videos, you know, to say, no, he's not responsible for his death. He didn't kill him and all that. But bro, all the videos that we are seeing where you attacked him while he was trying to shoot a music video with uh, Zlatan and the rest of them, the thing you should have done is explain to us what was the cause of that attack. Was he owing you money? Um, do you guys have a pending deal that um, he refused to keep? Um, did you pay him for a show that he refused to turn up? You know, there has to be something. Give us explanations. Give us explanations. You know, there, you know, there has to be something. Give us explanations. Give us explanations. You know. There, there must be a reason why you guys had misunderstandings. Of course, it's 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 um, it's not new for business partners to fall out. But then when there are videos, bro, you're talking about murder. Yeah, they say you keep person. Say see the videos of you where you do the threatening and saying that you kill him. Then by the time you come out, you say no, that video you not reach. Say I go kill him. Oh. See what thing happen. No. Oh. In I waiting do for me be this so oh, see what it cost the thing or oh, this are, so that you give us detailed explanations regarding the misunderstandings between you two except you are guilty. 
But then I, I've, I've not even heard anything from Naramali aside from the first post he did saying uh, wishing him, uh, I think it was uh, wishing his soul, maybe so rest in peace or something like that. So I've not heard any other thing from him. But I think I've seen about two or three videos where Sam Larry was trying to, you know, explain that not being kill him, that he gave misunderstanding. But bro, give us details. That attack where you go attack him during shoot, what did he do? The one where they say you attack him for club and all that. What did he do? What was the cause of those misunderstandings? What did happen? So that people go understand, say, oh, okay, if not, if not, what did he do with this? He not reach where he go come say he want make, he want killer. Because not too often now, nine people they point on to right now. Sam Larry and Naira Mali. Sam Larry and Naira Mali. And what you guys want to understand is this. Because they don't carry the case, go police station now. They, they don't exhume the body and all. Even if the Kaidi case go court, if court pronounce her uh, not guilty, on the uh, court of the streets, don't already sentence on her in case on her not know. That's for Sam, uh, Sam Larry and Aramali now. The street court don't sentence on her. You know, they jail for street court mind like this. They don't sentence on her. So, and because of how much um, doubt and all that um, we have in a judicial system, you know, because of how much Nigerians don't really, you know, with the fee say if you go court, they go run arm, they go do this one, they go do that one, say they're not gonna give us justice. So even if you know swing the way where we want them, say okay, they can't pronounce they say not be Naramali killer, not be uh Samlari. Samlari had nothing to do with his death, true true. You not consign streets as far as streets they concern now. Now na cousin. If they not kill him directly, they go say now nah, nah, push him, push him, and frustrate him to his death. So you guys have a whole lot of both damage control, reputation repair. I doubt if Olivia Pope will even feel repair on her on her reputation right now. You guys have no idea how deep this is. You have no idea how much of um of mess this has caused both um your career and the and I, I know if we did two pity Sam Larry. Sam Larry not really the entertainment industry, you know. But you see Naramali. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't know. I honestly don't know how much of um damage control that you would have to do to get out of this. So it takes a whole lot. And the earlier you guys start to do this damage control, the earlier you start to explain to streets the better because for uh, on a dog quiet on a dog go i just feel same on live and not be nigerians after two weeks now one thing could just happen one person says they could just leak now they go forget about the matter and i lie you i lie in case i never notice because the blood says now which one i don't the expect that same leave them not be nigerians once somebody sex they just leak now they could never notice because the blood says now which one i don't the expect that same leave them not be nigerians once somebody sex they just leak now they could just leave us alone it's not going to happen it's not happening this time bro you get it's not happening this time and it's even dangerous even when people call quiet when streets don't sentence on that when people quiet it's dangerous it's not even safe for you guys so the earlier on i start to the explain say okay you see that this particular video when i talk say i attack him see what he do this particular one see what he do we had a misunderstanding this one are waiting cause this one be this this one are waiting cause and be this this one are waiting cause and be this because the attack now eh, the evidence where they now where people they the way where they take the point and turn now eh, it blacks on a face in a joke but it's not it's not funny it's not funny. This thing is not going to. But I don't say go just blow past. You not go blow past. You not go blow past just like that. You know it's really, it's really crazy and it's so bad that um, such a such a, a young man with so much talent has in. <sighs> The way where all those videos come, they pop up as evidence, you know, it begs for a, a whole lot of questions. Because now, because they ask a way to, people will get these videos before. Why on a no release them before the guy die? But at the same time, you don't go to blame them. Everybody, they try safe in head. You get. And except you are an insider, except say, the only few people who are no say, suppose we collect this blame with their full chest, so say, yes, you can put the blame on us. Now, people where they in a circle with, um more bad if you day in inner circle and you are aware of all this mess 
Now, now they're supposed, you know, maybe blame just touching us more. But you see, for people that uh, we just saw the video online, there's then because not all those videos where they release now, not be all of them, they knew some came online at that time, you know. I think I saw about one or two then, even before he died then. But I had thought, well, it was the usual squabble between, you know, business partners, you know. A Malian record you did now, and everybody does say Malian record now, they represent gangsterism. Even at Amali, not the high down. You know, saying that gangsterism, they represent, their video represents gangsterism. You understand? So naturally, you will not say a bit of grand, grand small violence go there here and there. So when I saw, I think about one or two of those videos, then I thought, well, maybe not just the usual, you know, the grand, grand show of power, you know. Amalian music now. So naturally, there must be a touch of violence you get. But I'm sure that most people too, they never thought it would get to a stage whereby they'll call, push the guy, frustrate him. But we didn't know it was that much. We didn't know it was that it was that deep. That it will now cost his life. It's so sad. So different stories just they pop up here and there. You know, and they bury him before he die. He didn't die before they buried uh, buried him. It's so messy right now that uh, I honestly don't even know how or the best approach to handle the situation anymore because that the point the finger now don't even it does stretch not be just uh, Naramali and Samlari now some are even saying okay they need to ask uh, the two guys that were in the car with him the day he died who told them that he was dead there be medical practitioners or because they just he just they unconscious now he make them just begin shout say he's dead was it after they took him to the hospital and they pronounced him dead? Now those guys begin shout say he was dead, or now they don't assume say he don't die even before they took him to the hospital before a certified medical practitioner confirmed that he was dead. Was it before then? So there are lots of questions, a whole lot of questions to be asked. But as it is right now, to be asked. But as it is right now. I think what we should, in my own opinion, I think what we should prioritize right now is how to support the family as much as we can. The mother, the father, the wife, the child. You know, give them all the support that, um, that they need. You know, give them all the support that they need. And uh, this justice that we are looking for, let's be very tactical about it let's be tactical about it let's not give um the um the police and um, the system a reason to say they won't uh, they, they no go allow us uh, that we do, we are not allowed um, access to the information that we need why i'm saying that is see the candlelight procession where they do it was supposed to be a very peaceful candlelight gathered at uh, Morio Kuala Park or where was it? Had the candlelight. Everybody go out. But as usual, you know, saying our youth now, blood the hearts. I don't know who don't leave the squad. Say, oh yeah, let's go to two gates. I don't know. No. As, on the, as they just see on a gather for that two gates, what's it just come the government mind now? Hey, another NSAS blooming. Another NSAS in the making. You understand? Now, I made a just use their gas. Of course, what they did was totally wrong. It should have been another way to disperse the crowd, you know. But right now, we know the country where we did. You guys know the country that we are in. There was no reason for that gathering at that toll gate that night. So, why I'm saying this is that um, there will still be reasons for us to gather. There will still be reasons for us to ask more questions. Let's be tactical about it. More not serve, enter their hand. They just want a reason to shut us out. And once you give them the tiniest reasons, forget it. You know, once you give them the tiniest reason to say, oh, as we give on our leverage to go do ordinary candlelight procession, uh, procession and I don't see what turn, I turn on to, you get. So let's not make that mistake again. Let's be very tactical about it. The only time I think we should resist is when we see that, oh, uh, beyond every reasonable and unreasonable doubt, that they try to die the case, or they are trying to, you know, fine-tune it in a way that we know that they want to, you know, sweep it under the carpet and deny us uh, justice. 
uh, I'm not in any position to say that, oh, for sure, Naramali is guilty, Samlari is guilty. Yes, they are guilty of bullying. They are guilty of threatening that guy. They are guilty of frustrating him. But killing him, we need to be sure. Because that one, the accusation eh, is huge. And if they have sense, they need to start explaining themselves now. Forget saying she be the matter day police. Police go do their investigation, find out say no be we do them now. I think you guys should be even more worried trying to convince um um the court of the streets, the street courts, than the police. Trust me, you guys should be more worried about trying to convince the streets. Because Malian, now streets now, the street made you. You understand? The street made you. If we're going by uh, legality, your music, most of the things that you do, you, yeah, you will not say the law not really to support her like that. You get. Now the streets, they support your movement. Now the streets, they support everything where you do. So that streets, now I suppose find out and I want to convince. The longer one they keep quiet about this matter, the longer one they look guilty. If I don't know that one, I know now. The longer you are quiet about the situation, the longer you look guilty. So you guys have to start the damage control as soon as right now. You have to start, you know, all those videos where they come out, one by one, they explain what's happening for the video. This one, see the reason why we are, uh, I attack him here. See the reason why me and I'm um, quarrying. So, you know, you need to start explaining. I see the reason why we did this. See the reason why we did this. Whether the streets will believe you or not, at least play your part. Defend yourselves. But it's not quiet. It don't be like, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. Anything will happen, make it happen. We don't owe anybody any explanation. No, nah. Because if they accuse you, if I accuse you, say, bro, now you lick my soup. And you say, why they accuse you? I say, because I see uh, oil for your hand. You say, no, not be my oil, no. What do you need to now tell me? Be say, you see this oil where they my own hand? See where the oil come from. This oil not be from the oil of your soup. So you guys need to, you know, explain. You know, as they drop those videos of, say, uh, see where they bully him. They, they, if truly, if not, not, if not they innocent. If it was a business deal uh, that went south, or if it was misunderstand, what it cost the fight? Just tell, oh, this fight, see what it cost, see what it not cost. Her. You understand? So, um, once again, um, may his soul rest in perfect peace. And um, the picking where he leave, God go, go protect him. God go protect him. That guy would have done a whole lot. He had so much to offer. The way we're in debt take attract attention all over the world. You know that, no. Oh, yeah, did the guy head. You know, he carried so much grace and he had a whole lot to offer. But God knows best. It is what it is. Um, we will get justice. And I hope that one way or the other, uh, other upcoming artists that are desperate to blow, you've all learned one or two things. And the record label owners, Please, record label not be not be do or die. It's not a do or die matter. Terms and conditions. If terms and conditions not enter, everybody go in separate ways. Everybody go in separate ways. Not be as you no one draw a bidding. We go just we must we must everything uh, and uh, uh, we go we go frustrate time. We go beat time. We go no no. So please, guys, let's um, let's hope that in coming days we we'll get the justice that uh, that we are all hoping for, and that um, we we'll, we we'll learn to do better. We we'll learn to do better, please, especially youths, because now we carry this matter for head pass. When next there's a reason, when next there's a reason for us to gather on this matter, let's be tactical about it. Once we all agree that, oh, okay, the meeting is done, everybody go, may everybody don't go us. May everybody go us. You understand? So that they're not go, because right now, we will just give them reason to say, no, the last time we will allow on gather. See what's in our one turn them to for our hands. So please. And um, 
I'll keep you guys updated again on my opinion. Everything I've said so far, not my opinion, no, I beg. Not my opinion. I'm just, I just thought to think out loud and drop my one cent on this matter because um, it's been really bothersome. You know, it's been really bothersome. So let's hope that we'll get the justice that we are all hoping for. And um, let's support the family whichever way we can. Mm. I'll keep you guys posted on this same uh, platform. Please, guys, um, like, subscribe, and watch all the videos on UpTV channel. Please, UpTV.ng. Please, watch all our videos on this channel, and uh, there are more content coming in coming days. So thank you guys for your support so far. And uh, one more time, this post is dedicated to Mobad. Miss Gentle Soul rest in a perfect peace. Thank you, guys. Cheers.